Hi everybody, Jeremy here from Vigita Studio and today I'd like to share with you how to make your title work in a vertical timeline. So for Reels, Short, TikTok, unfortunately it doesn't work automatically but there is a workaround and I'm going to share it with you today. So if you're ready, let's check it out. All right, so in the edit page right now, I'm going to share with you how to make any title work with a vertical aspect ratio for short, TikTok, Instagram, etc. Most titles will work automatically when you drag them in the timeline and they will scale easily from HD to 4K to 8K as long as it is an horizontal format. So right now, we've just created a first timeline that is HD, so 1920 by 1080. If I were to create a second timeline that is 4K, and I drag the exact same title, it will naturally scale the title to 4K. So no issue right there. But as soon as you start using a vertical timeline, so here we're just gonna create a vertical timeline by switching here the format to custom and swapping here 1080 to 1920. So now we have a vertical aspect ratio that will be good for short TikTok and Reels. But if I try to drag here the title now in this timeline, as you can see, we have some weird stuff happening. Some part of our title have been stretched vertically and squeezed horizontally. This is because of the auto resolution in DaVinci Resolve not working properly, I guess, for vertical. So here, if you go to Fusion and we're going to take, for example, here that square. If I go to the rectangle, so here, that will be this one. So it will take the resolution here of this background. And here, if I go to image, as you can see, there is auto resolution. And that's what caused that stretch to happen. The auto resolution help us to just scale from HD to 4K. But in that case, it just changes the value and we end up with shape that are just stretch. Here, if I were to untick that, for example, and here reduce the height, as you can see, it would be way closer to the one that we want. But unfortunately, DaVinci doesn't do that automatically. There is probably an expression that could allow to do that automatically, but personally, I haven't found it yet. And I just hope that DaVinci figure out a solution to this problem and fix that with a future update. But still, you can use title on a vertical timeline. I'm just going to share with you how there is a workaround. The best way to go about it is to create a compound clip. So here, what I like to do is just select my timeline view option, just select the tab to be able to easily switch between a different timeline. Here, I'm gonna add a new timeline. Then here, we're gonna create a 4K timeline. You can do HD, but I prefer to do 4K and I'm gonna show you why in a second. So here, I'm just gonna create a 4K timeline, create that. So here, that's timeline number four. Then I'm just gonna drag here my title and now I can make any modification that I like. For example, here, adjusting the size and the position. That's why I choose to do 4K instead of HD is because then when you scale it with the size and position, you shouldn't lose too much quality. Then once that's done, you can just right click on your title, create a new compound clip, and then copy that compound clip and bring it to your vertical timeline. So here, I'm just gonna paste that in and here we go. Now it's working. You can then adjust the size of the title and the position directly in the inspector. And if you need to make further changes here to the text or stuff that are not available, like the size and position here in the inspector, you can always right click on your compound clip, go to open in timeline. And then here you'll have that tab opening with your title right there. We can just make some further modification like changing here the cross, for example, you can also adjust here the length of your title. And then if you go back to timeline three, now you can adjust also the length of your compound clip. And as you can see, the change has been applied also for the cross. And here you go, your title will work on a vertical aspect ratio. I hope that DaVinci update that soon, uh, but as of right now, that's the workaround that I'm using. And that's pretty much it. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let me know in the comment what kind of video you'd like to see next and see you in the next one. Bye. Speed up your workflow and create better videos using the pack available on our website, including titles, transition, and templates built only for DaVinci Resolve. Get started today by downloading our free starter pack that contain over 150 elements. Link in the description below or at videoeditorstudio.com.